Okay, so with three days off magnetic weapons, should have enough to buy a couple of upgrades for them. Sean Wright is going to be a really matter cleaning. Yeah, okay, this is the important thing right now. It's the stockade. Nat Moore's back. Oh, of course, Nat. Nat's a, Nat's a thing as well. Brilliant. Okay, assign your research. Yes, really good. So we've got magnetic rifle, the shard gun, which is the shotgun. Um, and gorse weapons is available to research. Really, really happy to get them this early. Um, we'll do the instant stuff because why the hell wouldn't we? To be frank, yeah, lovely. Arc blade. Okay, we wanna we wanna get all these upgrades for obvious reasons. So we need gauze weapons eight days, and we need plated armor fifteen days. I would hope to get another scientist in this day, so I'm gonna look at about eighteen to twenty days before we can go hit that that thing. We'll go for the plated armor first, I think, and we'll go to engineering, and we'll build items. And we'll get as many of these as we can right now. Shard gun. Oh, we need another engineer. Well, we're going to get one soon. We'll go for the magnetic rifle. And we'll go for... Can we get this now? And can we get this now? Sweet. Okay. I have no shame at all in getting all of my supplies wasted on that. Because it's not wasted. And we know it's not wasted. Right. Two days for another engineer. We put her straight to work. Sean Wright. Good for you, my lad. Lovely. Okay. That's for you, the room. Uh, so obviously we just spent all our, well, basically all our supplies, so we can't buy anything. So what we need to do is excavate this area with a net. And then when we get another engineer, I think I might just have him helping out. Because we want to go down here. Well, we need we need to clear everything out, really. So we can go and clear the alien debris out there with our, hopefully, very soon to be new engineer. Low engineers. Well, we're, 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 sort, we're sorting that right now. There we go. Establish contact with the local resistance network as soon as possible. The aliens are undoubtedly moving forward. We're doing it, man. We're, we're getting there, but we, we know what we can expect here, and we don't want to go in unprepared like we did in maybe a previous playthrough. <laughs> I think it's going okay. Once I get the first tier of weapons and armor, I'm not really going to necessarily rush it as much as I have been rushing this. I'll look at actually building the Avenger a bit. I'll look at the Proving Ground. I'll look at the, the Skulljack, etc., etc. We'll, we'll look at all of that business for now. But right now, we've got good intel. The Avatar Project's catching up a bit, but I don't think we need, really need to be too concerned about it just yet. Commander, the aliens continue to make progress we know, Bradford. We can see it. We have eyes, man. Don't panic. Right, anyway, let's just get the black market up. Eventually, we'll need it. Okay, let's view a mission instead. What do we got here? Rescue a VIP, and we get another engineer and a bunch of intel. Absolutely worth our time. Okay, so I think we're going to send the A team for this one because any time where we can get an engineer, we send our best available guys. Like that—that that should make sense. Are these our best available guys? Hudson Mabuza, Corporal Moore is more better than Nat. Squaddy, I, I liked Vega. Um, we've actually got a couple of upgrades here, even though, well, only Hijack can make the use of them. Let's take more out for now, because I wonder if Nat's better. Okay, well, let's have a look at let's have a look at numbers. More is two in three. Nat is five in three. Uh, sorry, more was three in two, wasn't he? I like Nat more. I think I think we'll give Nat more a go. He needs to be unshaken, so I think this might be a good opportunity to get him unshaken. Let's now have a look at actually upgrading these chaps in terms of this kind of stuff. Weapon upgrade. What have we even got? We've got superior hair trigger. Bonus action chance 15%. Why the hell not for her? Absolutely. And we will give her a combat sim of the mobility perception even. That's what we want. Lovely. Okay, so who's going to get mobility? I think Nat Moore can have the mobility. Uh, auto loader. First two reloads in a mission do not cost an action. Repeater. 10% chance to instantly kill your target when you hit them, regardless of the remaining HP. Well, that's certainly something we want to put onto a ranger, isn't it? But I have a feeling that I think Sean's earned that more. I like you, Nat, and that, and you can have the um, you can have the movement, but Sean's going to have the insta kill chance. We got to share the wealth, right? Got to share the wealth. New veteran customizations options. Additional options now available for our newly promoted veteran soldiers, eh? Woohoo! Okay, well, whatever customization it is, we are giving him right now. Oh, he's already got stock, hasn't he? Missed shot damage one. 
Oh, what do we think? Well, I mean, Sean doesn't miss very often, so I think we'll give him that. And then I think we'll give Hijack, who also doesn't miss very often, we'll give him... What can we give him? He can have two slots, as a matter of fact. Might as well give him both of these. Once a weapon upgrade is applied, it cannot be it can be replaced but not reused. Are you sure you want to apply extended magazine to this weapon? Yeah, man, why the hell not? Uh, we'll save that for someone else, I think. Okay, that's good. That's good. We're looking ready for this mission. Let's go do this. So we get another engineer, really good, and we get 94 intel. It's only an easy rating, so maybe we should be sending rookies, but right now, I don't really want to. You know, it's important. 94 intel. And another engineer. Why would we risk anything? There'll be another mission later on where we can send rookies, I should think. And now I think about it, we might have been better sending rookies because they're all going to have the upgraded weapon, aren't they? Because <laughs> they just have the normal weapon. Let's not worry about that right now. I'm confident in the guys that we've got on the ground right now. I said right now a lot then, didn't I? I said right now a lot right now, didn't I? Yeah. Right, anyway, rescue VRP. It's something I think is within a... Man, Vega's got fantastic hair. We can't have the best hair care products on the Avenger, but man, does she make the best of them. Sean, take note, mate. You're looking a bit greasy there. That being said, you have been through a lot. And scarred your faces. And you know what? Nat, your, your hair ain't looking... Has Vega just gone round and, like, taken all the conditioner and she's hidden it somewhere? And Sean and Nat and, you know, everyone else have been... Fran well, may maybe not Sergey. He doesn't have to worry about it. But Sean and Nat have been running around trying to look for it. And they just can't. She's hidden it somewhere high where only a sniper could reach. Anyway, let's let's get this mission loaded in, game, shall we? Got some guys here ready to kick some ass! Anytime now. There we go. Lovely. Okay. Let's do this, boys. I'm liking this team. I'm liking this team. Right, so rescue the VIP. Where are they? I believe we are going to be time orientated here. Okay, it looks like to be the kind of thing or the kind of mission here where blowing up some walls is going to be useful. So Wakuzuma Booza is going to have a fantastic time of things. Uh, that's not more. We want to get Vega wherever she is. There she is. I'm going to put her there straight away. That's a ticket. Okay, we do see enemies. Ooh. Okay. Yeah. Right. Okay. Um. Was I expecting to see one of them this early? If I'm honest, no, I wasn't. I'm going to take things a little slower. I know we're concealed. But if they see us, we ain't concealed. So we might as well just... Get our overwatches and things on Roger. here. And if they if they patrol up the other way, then we can set an ambush up properly. But right now, I wanna I don't wanna risk anyone. Got Concealed. I kinda wanna save a couple of grenades. Now we've got our two our two chaps that are gonna be looking to get some slashes on, so we're just gonna put them here. Got it. Where they can hopefully get down on the ground next turn. Maybe when we go to the black site, we we could find Sean's sniper rifle. Maybe he can regain the old, your fingers will remember your strength if they held your sniper rifle. Right, these guys are going to patrol towards us. No, they're not. That's quite lucky. And gives us a really good opportunity to take that mech out before it can do damage. Right, Vega's in a great position, but we can get these guys on the ground now. And that's certainly what I want to do. So we'll get Wakeza Mabuza down here. Good stuff, lad. Good stuff. We'll get... This is going to be Sergei. We'll get him here. Good copy. Moving on target. Yes, it is a good copy, my son. Right, and then Sean and Nat. Uh, Sean can get to that. Can cover that. Then maybe Nat by that hologrammy thingy majig. Okay, we're still going to be overwatching and things. Running. I really don't see why we, why we should be overly aggressive right now. We're in a good position, I think. Overwatch. Concealed. Yes, what you said. So are they going to patrol back to us? If they do, then we might. Oh, and they're not. Okay. Well, wherever they go, we're in a great position. If we can just get a couple of... Ooh, 
with the Viper and a Stun Lancer from what I can see. Yeah, that's definitely a sword. Okay. We've got 11 turns. That's a long time. We want to make this ambush count, really, don't we? Okay, so what we'll do is we'll get Valentine into here. Okay. Okay, now what kind of percentages are we looking at? Oh, oh man, really? Oh man, really decent percentages. Okay, so we'll overwatch him. We'll get Wakesma Booza to here and overwatch him. We'll get Snap more. Probably up to here and overwatch him. Vega's going to initiate this, by the way. I, I just want to make sure that we're going to have everyone available to hit this mech if we need everyone available to hit this mech. And then make sure, secondly, that we're going to be in a decent position if lots of enemies bust out of that building, which I think they might. And I think I think we've done a pretty good job of that for the most part. Now we can shoot that mech 100% on both of these because she's just an amazing human being. We've got more powerful weapons on the ground, so I'm going to shoot the weaker enemy with her. 100% I mean, a kill, right? And then we've got four guys chucking shotguns and advanced mechanic, magnetic, whatever the hell's into that mech. Including a heavy that shreds armor. So let's kill this advent trooper. Oh, that was a beautiful thing to see, wasn't it? Right. Let's end this mech. Yes. 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 This is going to be a glorious sight. It's running! I want to see numbers, boys. Good numbers from Sergey. Great numbers from Sean. Beautiful, lads. Beautiful. That worked out brilliantly. Now, we know there's a couple in the building. I expect to see them this turn. And there, indeed, they are. Hello, boys. we still got two guys on Overwatch. One of them is going to... Take five off that Viper. Man! There's some, there's some on-form chaps here. Problem now is I'm not sure Sean is completely actually in cover, but I don't think that's going to matter because Kalega Vega is going to go kill someone again. Uh, Advent Sunlight's at 80% or 60%. Well, I think we take the 80, obviously. Oh my god, she's unstoppable! Amazing! I think we might have found the spirit of Gaffer in this one. Right, anyway, Valentine Hudson. Um, here and then kill it. We do have a grenade. I kind of want to save the grenades. I think 57% is decent. Of course it's decent. This is Sean F. in Hudson, man. He don't miss. He don't miss ever. Apart from the times he does, and then we'll, we'll look over it. And He's got a bit of an attitude with him now, though, isn't he? Happy now. He was like, I, I did it right beforehand, but I guess how can you go through what he's gone through and not have an attitude, especially when it was the commander that kind of put you into that situation. Anyway, that was a really good start to the mission. In fact, I don't think we could have done better, to be honest. Let's get some overwatches now, because there are more enemies crawling about. We've got lots of time. You know, we don't need to worry really about time at all. So we're going to... Well, what we're going to want to do, I would imagine, is get in here. So, Sean, do you just want to have a quick look, see if there's anyone going to ruin our day if we do that? Not by the looks of things. Okay, um... Kalega Vega, great job from your position, but I think time now from this position has kind of seen us done, so we'll get her down to here. Graciela, not Kalega. Why am I calling her Kalega? Well, I like her. She's amazing. Right, okay, we'll get uh, Sergei probably to here as well. We've got enough time to do our trick of Overwatch and creep forward. I misclicked that. I was supposed to put it in the other side of the wall. Please don't bite me in the arse game. No, it hasn't. That's fine. Okay. In fact, we might as well move Sean Hudson in a bit now then in that case. What's over there? Well, we're going to find out, mate. Lovely. And then Nat Moore. Well, we might as well send him up as well, right? Running. Lovely stuff. Lovely stuff, boys. Lovely stuff. Hijack we will put on an Overwatch. Got just in go. case. Okay, that was that. Well... The guy, we just need to blow a hole in the wall, right? Or can, or can we actually get in there? No, I think we need to blow a hole in the wall. Well, that's why we're saving our grenades. Uh, I'm going. Sean, man. I love you, man. Even with an attitude, I love you. Good copy. Moving on target. Thank you, Nat. 
Uh, Nat, do you want to do the honours, mate? Uh, I believe that... Wait, where's where's our way out? So we're going to need to go that way. So we'll, we'll blow a hole in this wall, and then we'll get him out and blow a hole in this wall, and then we can run that way. That should give us good cover. Okay, yeah, let's do that. Definitely, we definitely do need to blow that up, right? Yeah, I think probably safest way of doing it, i.e. not blowing the actual VIP up, is by putting it there. That was a scarily big explosion, but has it worked? Can we get our guy out now? I think we've got a way in. No. No, we don't. Where's the doorway, then? Oh, it's around here. Well, I don't regret trying, you know. Let's get these two in. They can have a look at it. It might be that we're, we're, we've, we've got no more resistance on the map, but I highly doubt that. Yeah, so what we'll do is we'll... I'll tell you what, we'll have Wakessa and we'll have Grace. I'm going to... Yeah, we'll just call her Grace. They can go and cover these windows now ready for our escape. The other three can go get the VIP and run him to the extraction point. That's the idea. Order's confirmed. Moving out. There we go, Vickers. Overwatch. Right, so Valentine. We'll just overwatch you for now. Got it yeah, you do. You're Sean effing Hudson, man. So the grenade... Oh, the grenade did work. Hey, okay. Brilliant. Um, Sean, go pick our guy up. Actually, maybe not. I don't know why, but something's telling me it's going to be a faceless. I hope it's worth it. it will be worth it, Sean. It will be, man. Right, so Hijack can come in here. Is it clear? Well, that's what you're going to find out, bro. We st oh, no, wait, we, we can't get in there? I am so drastically confused as to whether we can actually get in here or not. I don't think we can. Right, Nat, you're going to have to go do it, my friend. Understood. The other yeah. the other two will come for you. You can do it as a team. Okay, and then, as I said, Colega Vega can get there and cover our run. And then she can just come in afterwards. And so can Wakesa Mabuza. We'll get him at the doorway. Roger that. Beautiful. I'm on it. Okay, so these two actually got it wrong. They've got to go this way. What's over there? Uh, yeah. We'll overwatch. If there's going to be more enemies on the map, they're going to be there, aren't they? Let's be honest. Um, what, what can you hack, Sergey? Oh, God, have we got to hack the doorway to get in? Oh, man, that's going to be tough. Let's not do it yet, because it will give him a chance to run away, won't it? All right, I'll go. Let's get around there and do it. So when we go in here, I'm going to send Sergey in first, because then if we do see enemies... Wait, oh, don't tell me that's open now. Oh, I don't even know what's going on with this. We'll send Sergey in first. All right, I'll go. Okay, we'll send Sean Hudson in first, because I misclicked. Because if there are enemies, then we can go swipe them, slash them, whatever. Although, really, I think we'll be okay just shotgunning them. Hopefully. We'll certainly slash that sectoid if we can, please, Nat. Beautifully done, my lad. Beautifully done. So then Sean would have gone and slashed the other one. But, uh, yeah, that would have been... Is it? Because there's enemies by him. What is going on? Where even... So now there is a hole in the wall. I don't even know, man, what's going on right now. And there? that was, I'm pretty sure, not where my cursor was. 59%. Let's kill him. Let's 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 not kill him. Instead, yeah, that's that's a good option that we could do. Um, I'm worried that that green thing could explode, but 68% to kill that trooper. Sean Effin Hudson, man, you always rely on that guy. Okay, these two just overwatching, of course. Oh, we... So, can you get out, mate? Oh, we could get out that way? There was a doorway there? That is a weird old place, isn't it? I guess... I guess... I guess he creeped out of somewhere that we... I don't know, guys. I don't know what happened. What I do know, though, is Wakesa Mabuza is about to blow a big, fat hole. Actually, no. Wakesa Mabuza is not going to do anything. Sergey... No, who, who's still got to do stuff, man? 
It's Wakesa, yeah, he's on Overwatch. I thought we'd already clicked that. Of course they are. That's why we got two guys ready to cover right now. So that'll come in in a turn. I like where Grace is. I'm going to move Wakesa just to here and get some kind of flank on. And an Overwatch. Valentine, get your grenade, mate. Blow a big old hole in that wall if we can. And then we can run our VIP to safety. Frag out. Who needs doorways when you've got grenades? Grenades are your doorways. Right, okay, nap more to here. Stepping off. I would put Sean on the other side, but I'd rather the guy didn't catch fire, you know. That would uh, I don't think he deserves catch fire after what he's been through. Um we'll put our guy there. I think he'll be safe enough. We got stuff to go pick up. Do I want to go pick it up? Quite frankly, I'm sick of that room, but if we can just maybe go here and pick it up, then I will go. I'm going. That's okay, Sergey. You bit you bit tired, are you, mate? Laser sight. Sick. It's over here. Man, people don't seem up for it today, do they? Sean's in a bad mood. Sergey seems to be in a bad mood. Still, they're performing, and that's what matters. Right, what do we got? Stun two stun lancers and a normal trooper, is that? Simple enough. Let's get some bullets on them, lads. They're gonna run, they're gonna trick some overwatches. Oh, Wakesa! Oh, Wan, that was a miss. That didn't look like a miss. Great, show him how it's done. She got it together. I don't think that was enough to get the kill, but it's a great job. No, it was not enough to get the kill. But that's fine. And we've got guys all over the place now. In a good way. Menace one five. Hostile interceptors are on high speed approach. Your window for extraction is closing. Oh no, she's got a reload. Um Can she shoot? Alright, let's get out and do pistol stuff. 53% with a pistol. Let's do it. Ooh. Key. That was not good. Should have reloaded her while she was waiting on Overwatch. That's that's kind of just lazy. Lazy X coming from me. I would like to get Wakesa Mabuza to here. And this guy's still got two grenades. Let's use them, shall we? Uh, best way of using them. Kill that guy, blow up the other guy's cover. Good idea. That's the job. Oh, I didn't blow up the cover. Never mind. Never mind. We got Sean and Nat about to run out with swords and shotguns everywhere. Upgrade for that guy. Deserved, I would say. Right, so, Nat Moore. Are we going to slash with you, my friend? I think that wouldn't be a bad idea. I'd rather slash that guy, though, if I'm honest. That guy's going to cause us more horror if he was allowed to live. But he wasn't because Nat is a great, great ranger. Sean, how about you go take the other guy guy? The other guy guy? The other guy. And then we can get Sergei out and just... Oh, we can't see the other guy guy. That's a shame. I was hoping he would see the other guy guy. He still can't see the other guy guy. Are we serious here, Sean? That's okay. You can see the other guy guy now, I bet. Right. Songbook Jong, you stay there for the second. We'll get Sergei here. He can definitely see the other guy guy. And he can kill the other guy guy for 45%. I feel like we could do that. Oh, unlucky, man. Unlucky. I think you got to try the 45%. You'll hit 9 out of 20. It's decent numbers, isn't it? Right, Sungbuk Yong. Um, I don't want to put you in harm's way. But we need to get you moving, don't we? So let's put you there. Okay, you should be safe. Should is the key word. It's only an advent trooper. What's the worst that could happen, right? Uh, like he could flank Sergei and then uh, apparently just go on Overwatch and then run into Sean's shotgun. Of course he could! Overwatch removed in the most glorious way. Right, let's get our VIP out there. That's cool, Sean. Don't worry about it, bro. You've done well today. Right, goodbye, Sunbuk Yang. You're welcome, by the way. 
Uh, we'll get Nat Moore in that. A good performance from him. Evac. Lovely. So yeah, really good performance. Well, Kezimabuza can get in as well. Double time. Double time. Evac there. VIP Evac secure. there. VIP uh, can we get Grace all the way this turn? Oh, just no. Okay, we'll wait a turn there. We'll keep the other two just in case more advent come. We can run out together. Although I don't really think it's going to matter. In fact, we'll get Sean out because I think he's run out of ammo, hasn't he? Oh, and he has to stay there because he's already done his actions this turn. Okay, so Sergey can just stay to guard Grace and Sean away. But no, I don't think there was really any need. Oh man, we only have one turn left. I should have kept a close eye on that. That could have been terrible. But it's fine, man. It's fine. Yes, Immerta. Lovely. Great job, guys. Hijack that rope, mate. Back home for biscuits and medals. So was that flawless? You better believe it. That was flawless. Okay, and we got a couple of promotions there that I saw. You get the intel, we get another engineer. Mo no one was the most under fire because we didn't allow any alien time to shoot at us. Now that is flawless. Successful shot percentage, only 50%. Could have been better on another day, but then I still don't think the Overwatch hits count because it should have been way higher. I don't really even think that the sets were there. Yeah, whatever, man. Matt Moore did well. Sean did well. I think those two are going to be big players for us. You know, gender confusion or whatever the hell. Who cares? As long as you can kill enemies, you're welcome in our team. So, maybe now these guys are growing out. Maybe Grace could share the conditioner about. You know, I'd certainly think these two could do with some. But I guess that's on her. That's not really something I feel like the commander needs to degrade himself with. Okay, jolly good stuff, guys. A lot of promotions there. Nine kills in three missions. That's so Hudson, isn't it? Most people get in four and seven. Certainly these two, Corporal Mabuza. Um, ooh, what one do we want to do here? Unleash a volley of bullets at your target's cover, destroying it but deals no damage to the target. Fire a barrage that pins the target, granting a reaction fire if it moves and imposing a minus 50%. I think we'll go for the suppression. I seem to remember that being very, very useful in the previous XCOM. I, I, I just think this line is way stronger than this line. This line's interesting, but when it actually comes to a mission, this is way better. You know. And then Vega. Uh, we, we'll give her an actual sniper loadout. Lovely. Okay, well, all in all, jolly damn good. We'll put this guy to work straight away. Wild child, Nat Moore. I think that suits him. Oh, wait, he's shaking. Oh, no, he just recovered. Oh, brilliant. Everyone's recovering. Sunbuk Yang. Okay, right. Let's get her, I believe, to work. Hey, Commander. Hey, thanks for not reading me an essay. Now I spoke to you. Um, yeah, we can clean this. Do we need to clean this? Because we're going to build a... There, yeah, we might as well just clean it. Okay, this is really good. The stuff that's happening now is happening very nicely. I'm going to end the episode here, my friends. It's been a short one, as a matter of fact, but it's it's pretty late. I'm sorry it's a bit short. I'd have liked to have done it longer. Well, let's have a look at this transmission first. Avatar Progress 4, but otherwise we did pretty well. Corporal Adam O'Carroll and Dr. Emily Jones are available. Um, I think we've got enough intel to reveal that. We're all checkpoints, resistance in format. Oh, my lord. The aliens find a mole within the resistance, reducing retaliation by two weeks. Don't really want that. Aliens hide in ambush along the populace, placing hidden faceless aliens on each mission. Advent stifles the movement of resistance and loses our supplies. I don't really want any of them to happen. We need to go get those supplies. Let's go investigate that. We're just waiting on our upgrades before we go for the black site. If we can even get six guys to hit the black site, then that'd be good. Um, not now. Because we're going to go look at the supply drop first. And then we'll just, you know, we'll collect the supplies wherever we can. Not, not, ooh. 
received word that the aliens have completed a facility devoted to their work on the Avatar. Good, because it's something we can now go destroy. And it's something I think we certainly should think about trying to go destroy very soon. Yes. Right now we're doing, we're getting supplies because we need supplies. Because we need to equip our guys to actually go kill these black sites. As yet we do not have that equipment. We will soon. New staff available. I don't really think we need to worry about that just yet. We've got black market still to do. But right now I care about the service depots. And then when we do research the armor, we can get it for everyone straight away. When we do research the upgraded sniper rifle and the heavy rifle, we can get that straight away. And then we're definitely going to be ready to go hit the black site. I think easily. Okay, new targets. Quiet! Let's have a look. Commander. With the number of contacts we've established, we're getting requests for support. That gives us a Grandir Corporal. That gives us intel. The resources to respond to one of them. The decision is yours. I'd like to do both of these. In the sense that I don't really think we need another Grenadier. But I'd really like to counter that dark event. On the other hand, this is an easy mission, which means we can send rookies and hopefully get some more level ups. And I really don't want that to happen either. So I think we'll go for this one. And I think what we'll do is we'll send Vega and we'll send Zichenko and we'll send three rookies. What rookies shall we send, you ask? Well, the three rookies that we have. There we go. There we go. Okay, so hopefully we get some level ups here. I think it should go pretty well. Let's do it. And all of these guys have got the upgraded weapons, so we might even be stronger than we were previously. Anyway, as I said, I'm going to end the episode. So I will end the episode as we see these guys off to their mission. Thanks for watching, everyone. I'll see you next time.